The moment we've all been waiting for. Our first PSA submission in return. Let's get it. I don't know which box has which cards in it, but we'll find out. We'll start. Heavy. Oh, this is lighter, so we'll start with the heaviest one. Alright. PSA sealed this box really good. One tape on that side. Alright. Hallelujah! Damn. Alright. Bro, we're starting left to right side. Or should we just pull them all out? Left side. Left side? Yep. Alright, I'll see if I can pull it out. You know what? You gotta slide them all out like this. You gotta be careful. Oh. I can see color. I see the first Char Wizard. You know what? We're gonna start bottom up like this. All right, first card. Let's see which side is the is the number on. I don't even know, but you know what? Let's just reveal it. Ooh, the Bulbasaur from One Fifty One Illustration Rare, PSA Ten. This is the first Bulbasaur we pulled from the One Fifty One booster packs. Nice. Clean. Is there a dust right there? No, that's Can't just do. that's just lint. Here you go. Next card. Wow, ten. That's pretty. Back cool. looks really clean. No whining. Centering looks a little right heavy. Let's just cover the top. I don't know how to do this like this. Okay. Pikachu, illustration rare. 10. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. It's clean. Next card. Poliwhirl. Let's see, how does it look? Looks pretty clean to me. Champ Mint 10. Damn, we had 10 tens, 20 on this. Next card. Erica's Invitation. Ultra rare. This is not the SIR. Boom. 10. 10, 10, 10. <laughs> I want to see it. <laughs> Erica, this looks nice too. Which card is this? My, my baby. Alakazam, 151. Sham Mint 10. Ooh, this is nice. This is definitely going into the into the shadow box frame. It's a lot of tens. I know, right? <laughs> Who doubts PSA? Do they give every card a 10? I think they felt bad. They felt bad? This is our first submission? <laughs> wow. Okay. Dragonair. From 151. The 10? Gem Mint 10. Oh, wow. I think they messed up. I don't know, but these cards, the centering, it looks really, really good. Another 10. Next card in the set. Ooh, the Mew. Hyper Rare. It's the gold card. Not 10. Damn. Oh, wow. Another 10. Must have paid PSA extra so they could give us 10s. Right. If I threw an extra $20 bill in the box. $20 gift card. <laughs> All right, his the Hyper Rare, the Switch card from 151. A 10. Damn, oh, Jeff and Ted. Wow. <laughs> wow. Okay. Damn, this is like cheat codes unlocked. <laughs> wow. All right, next card. Uh, looks kind of left heavy, right? 
a little left heavy. Uh, you know what? I bet PC gave another 10 for this. Let's see. Is it Charizard EX? Nine. Wow. First nine from the collection. Okay. All right. That's fine. I'm not sad. I'm actually happy. Because not that many people actually get the Charizard EX graded, but who knows? Maybe in the future, 10, 20 years from now, this will pay for my, my future child's uh, college education. It'll pay for full tuition. <laughs> Next card in the set. Man. No whiting. Clean. These are all clean cards. Freshly pulled from pack. Zapdos. Ooh, I was worried about this one because the the front centering is a little lopsided. I think it's a little drifting, drifting to the left. Mint nine. Yep. This is definitely not a PSA 10, but we'll take it. Next card in the batch. Another Poliwhirl. Gem Mint 10. Ooh. Okay. We have two of these, right? Yep, we oh, got yeah. two of those. We take two. those. We take those. Why this is more shiny than this? Really? Yeah. Oh, we'll, we'll have to take a oh, closer wait. look at it after. They're all the same. We're just lighting. Here's the War Turtle. I was really excited about this one when we pulled it. Boom. Gem Mint 10. We take it. Water? 10s all day. Okay. I... Submitted the, the blast stories to Squirtle and the War Turtle in a sequential order, so we'll see what they all come back with. Here's another clean card. Oh, here's the Blasty Boy. Let's go. Come on, show me the money. Jump in 10. Let's go. So, this blast stories was actually. A card I picked up off of um, an eBay listing. There were bids running for you know between about thirty to forty dollars at the time, and I picked this up raw, ungraded for about about forty bucks, and it came back at ten. It was worth it. Nice. Next card in the set is another Charizard EX from 151 that we pulled personally from the booster packs. Most likely from a UPC, I think, because those were the ones we opened up initially. Gem, oh, not a Gem Mint 10, is a 9. All right, that's fine. No sweat. Next card. Uh, this is a 9? Yeah. Just two of these 9s? Yeah. Ooh, the big boy. The big wizard. Let's see. Let's take a close look. What do we think this is? 10. We think this is a 10? 9. Let's see. I'm trying to trying to take a closer look. Back looks really clean. Moment of truth. Ooh, PSA 9. Let's see. Why did they dock this a 9? I'm trying to see if this was the card with the... With the little print blob. I can't tell, but... Oh, it's definitely the centering. The centering on the left-hand side is a little thin and a little shifted. So, it wasn't looking too pretty. But maybe there's another imperfection in it. I'll have to take a closer look at it. Next card coming up. Take a look at the back. Let's see, let's see what we get. Oh, another Charizard EX. I think we had three or four of them in the submission. And this one is, ooh, this is the Gem Mint 10. We'll take it. Out of the three or four that we submitted, this one came back a 10. 10. Cool. So this is gonna stay in the collection. So what, nine of these? I mean, uh, oh wait, this is a 10. I thought it was a nine. Yep, that's the 10. Cool. Next card in the set. Ooh, the Squirtle. This was the the first IR card I pulled from 151. This was out of a, a UPC. Oh, 
All right, let's see where we got. Jamintan. All right. So I submitted the, the Squirtle, the War Turtle, and the Blastoise together, and they are all sequential. This one's starting at um, 255, and the next is 256 and 257. So that's going to stay in the uh, personal collection. Next card. Oh, wow. Another Pikachu. Pikachu Illustration Rare. Let's see. I feel good about this one. Boom. Gem Mint 10. So we got two PSA 10 Pikachus. Nice. Oh, Squirtle, War Turtle, Blastoise. Yep. That's the all three. All yeah. tens. That's the only fully evolved set we had, I think, from the set that we, we pulled. Oh, you said, you said, like, these are the same one. His Charizard. Let's see. Centering looks pretty solid on this one. We definitely are aiming for a 10. And what do we got? Yes. Yes, sir. PSA 10. Nice. Sweet. We take it. Next card coming up. Ooh, the Charizard, the full art, ultra rare. This was the one I pulled from the, the booster boxes. Um, they contain about six packs a box. And this was the, the first, actually, Charizard that I pulled from, from 151. The other cards mm -hmm. were pulled from my wife and my brother. They, they got their first Wizards. In the beginning when they were ripping packs and i finally got this one so that was exciting yes gem mint 10. it's really nice especially how the the wing extends out to the far right on the border so most of the times you can see that the blue part of the wings can get like frayed or slightly misprinted so this is nice All right, last card in the stack from this box. Let's see what it is. Clean, looks clean. Ooh, another SIR Charizard. So we actually had three of the SIRs submitted to PSA, and so far one came back at nine, the other came back at 10. And this one, boom, gem mint 10 try and distinguish which one is which, but they all look the same because there's no particular order. Because I think we were thinking that one of them or two of them were going to come back at nine, but out of three, two tens, solid. I think current value for the PSA 10 Charizards are between, I think last time I checked, about 350 to 400. It, it might have dropped a little, but especially 151, all the OG collectors are are going to want to keep these cards in a personal collection. Yeah, see if we could figure out which, why the Charizard came back a 9. Because I can't tell they all look the same, besides the centering. So this is the last box from the PSA submission. That's the one? Yeah. I'm surprised it came in at 10. Right? I think I thought this I think it's the 10. centering that 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 made or break it between a nine or a ten. This one's hard to open. Which side is sealed? Sorry for fumbling through the box. This is yeah. I can't pull open the box. Oh you know what? I'm an idiot. The sides are, are taped. <laughs> I 
I beat up the box a little bit. <laughs> All right, got the submission slip in there. And we did get one card back that wasn't graded because it was uh, tampered with from, from like 2000. <laughs> but we'll go over that soon. Oops, I just revealed the Charizard. <laughs> <laughs> Epic fail, but you know what? You guys already saw that one as a four in, and we'll get to it. All right, basic energy, sweet gem mint ten. So far, on these submissions, um, we only got a few nines out of out of uh, the twenty five that we submitted. PSA ten energy, we'll take it. Next card. Oh, here's the, the SIR Erica, Erica's Invitation. We pulled this one directly from, so I think at UPC as well, four nines? Four nines. Shoot. Gem Mint 10. Nicer. All right. It's... PSA is just handing out tens. I mean, these these cards look really, really nice. The edges and everything, they're pretty clean. We'll take it. We'll take it. All right, so the card inside. <laughs> this is the one that uh, was ungraded because of the... The slightly damaged ding that was uh, tampered with from long, long time ago. This was my, my brother's personal, personal, personal card from the binder that we had since like year 2000. You know what? I think I could slide it out. Let me see. Yep. Oh, look, they even included a little label too. Oh, snap. Okay. Nice. So let's see. Recolored, <laughs> do not hold her. Blaine Charizard, hollow. So this Charizard that my brother pulled from from the Japanese set, the Blaine's Charizard, had a slight dent that he actually colored long, long time ago with like a Sharpie. It bottle. was a Sharpie or it was a dry erase marker? I think it was a colored pencil. A colored pencil? So you see that little blue? little coloring because of that took a sample of it, sent it to a PSA took a DNA sample and determined that this Charizard is indeed tampered with recolored they knew it was recolored it's not amazing how they figured that out I remember I <laughs> so we're gonna put this in a slab. a clear slab <laughs> and we'll we'll see if we could cut this little label out fold it in <laughs> And it'll be recolored in the slab. They didn't give me a one. Didn't give me this a is not a peelable sticker. Zero. Maybe, maybe it might be peelable. We'll we'll have to see. If not, we could just cut it out, and we'll um put it in a slab. It'll be the unofficial official PSA slab. All right. So here's the last card in the collection. I actually revealed it earlier, but we'll do the we'll still do the uncovering. So this is the Charizard from base set two. And it's from 2000, so it's been over 24 years. So for this card to be in this condition, it's been sitting in the binder for, shoot, forever. And we're just like, let's just submit it. And this card actually has a, a holographic swirl on the left-hand side. So final reveal. Very good, EX. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. VG, I'm assuming very good. Or an excellent EX. It's a four. I remember I played that card like on This the, is yeah. On the ground. This card Actually. has has touched the dirt. It has Oops. dwelled in pockets. It has been brought Play everywhere. Play with it in recess. Without any type of top loaders or clear sleeves. And that thing was in my pocket, like when I went to school. Wow. So it is like 
sweat and everything that's just like fermented in the card. My boogers. <laughs> and boogers. But PSA 9, I mean, no, it's not PSA, PSA 4. This will be in the personal collection and you can see the border is definitely left heavy. But a mint condition of this card, like, who knows what it would have gotten if the centering was a little bit more decent. Maybe it could have gotten a 7 or 8, who knows. But to have a card in this condition, that's seen everything, it's definitely worth it. You get those cards graded uh, through PSA. Uh, do a bulk submission, it'll run for about... I think they're doing like a promo, like a dollar off or something if you're submitting 20 cards or more in the bulk submission. You'll have to double check that on the website. So let's uh, do a quick recap. So about how many 10s did we end up getting? So here's a sequential Squirtle, War Turtle, Blastoise. You get the Pikachu. So most of these cards are all from 115 to 1, besides the Charizard. And here are the SIRs, two tens and one nine. We will take it. Thanks for watching, guys. This is the first PSA submission. Drop comments, drop likes, subscribe if you like what you see, and there'll be future videos. Thanks for watching.